Welcome. Um, this is the energy vibration reading for um, the um, Aries Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and supplies. Okay, you Aries. Okay, okay. Um, let me close these windows. Okay, you, you Aries. Okay. Um, this month is a wonderful month for you Aries because it's actually um, the month of the devil and the energy of the organization. Okay, so this is going to be wonderful. This is going to be good for you guys. Um, let's see what is up then for you Aries. Okay, so um, let's go back to the drawing table and see. This month is um, have four weeks. It is a fire energy. This is wonderful because you guys have judgment so it's breakthrough information is going to come through and that sort of a situation so this is going to be um a fair fair less month for you guys okay i need to have some space okay so let's see what is happening what is transpiring and i just want to have this red thing behind me um i don't know what <laughs> I, I just think this week, I just want to have this red thing behind me, so. All right, you Aries, let's see what's happening for the Aries. Um, let's call up on the angels and guides, the uh, guided angels, the goddesses, the ascendants, masters, all the angels and angels, or um, um, the angels and guides of the Aries. Um, please come in and show us what is happening for the Aries in the month of September in these four weeks. So in the first week, um, you Aries have in a strength in the month of September. So um, whatever the situation is, whatever that is transpiring, you Aries have a strength. But if you look behind you, it's as if your spirit guides is showing you how much they love you and um, just keep on going at it because uh, um, as you defeat your enemies, um, there is a new um, possibilities and a new opening that is about to come up for you so um, basically it's um, the first week is going to be you defeating um, the situation or people um, that has been basically blocking you because there's a beautiful um, outside in that cave because obviously um, you're defeating this liar um, so you can get outside okay um, I love these cards these are the mystical cards I um, this is the first time I'm working with them um, so a lot of you or you know will see um, just different things but it's not that for starters it's just you know basically a deck for um, professional people okay let's see what is coming up in the second week and I want to say thank you so much to Aries for the likes, shares, and support and everything that has been oh, happening. My um, earphones are not here. Okay. So I want to say to you, Aries, thank you for the likes, shares, and support. Please um, um, support this channel by um, just thumbs up, likes, and shares. And um, I want to say that in the second week, the Knight of Swords, whoever this Knight of Swords is, uh, um, this could be information, someone coming to you um, with, um, you know, hash words and that sort of a thing. And that's why you have to find inner strength and guidance because obviously um, there is a situation that is playing out and someone is coming at you with some real harsh words. Okay. And you have to find the inner strength to stand your ground so that you don't, um, you know, it's as if you are um, basically protecting yourself from a negative situation. And this um, could be happening in the second week. Okay. Let's see what's happening in the third week for you Aries um, in the third week for you Aries um, you have the energy of the nine of swords in reverse so this is good um, in the third week the worries is all over okay whatever that was going on in the first week and the second week in the third week um, this is now over um, whatever you were worried whatever you were trying to slay the beast at in the first week it's no longer happening uh, it's moving on and in the third week uh, um, you're releasing um, this worries which is good like in the third week some news or information come in and you're 
um, a release in this four weeks and five of cups so you have some regrets you really really have some regrets about a situation that has been going on whatever the situation is there is really some regrets because um, there are um, so many cups turned over four from the five cups is turned over you have only one um, it's as if you have um, so much regrets about something that has transpired because um, you're trying to find inner strength and moving forward with the Knight of Swords with the energy and the Knight of Swords um, and you have some you know the worries is there um, you don't have the worries anymore but um, the energy of the five of cups which I mean there is some regrets and loss there is um, a loss um, really a loss because for uh, there is something that you have lost so, okay let's see what is happening in the first week going in the second week because obviously um, you're finding in a strength because someone is coming at you um, with um, you know a horrible horrible um, a way of speaking to someone you have the two of swords whatever the energy is of the two of swords is that you're seeing a situation for what it is it's as if finally um, it's as if uh, this could be for three women out there that was having um, or you know three persons out there that was having a, a conflicts and now they're bringing this conflicts to an end it's as if they're seeing that someone was playing them against each other and now they're ending this conflicts and bringing this conflicts uh, to an end because here you can see that in the first week you're trying to um, you know some people could be trying to figure out uh, who is lying and who is telling the truth and that sort of a thing and it's as if a group of people came together to see who was lying and who um, was saying the truth. So, you know, the Knight of Swords, the energy with the Knight of Swords is that the Knight of Swords is going to bring you information that is going to um, um, release you of your worries, whatever it was. Because obviously, um, there was a situation where you had to find inner strength in the first week of September, whatever that was going on, whatever information, whatever situation that was going on around you. But then um, it's as if you spoke to your sisters, your family, your girlfriends, you know, people, and you finally um, found out the truth to what was going on. Okay. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. This is the first time. Congratulations, you Aries. This is the first time a queen has come up in this whole monthly reading. I swear, people, it comes up in the other general reading, but not in this monthly read and the queen of ones so you guys are standing your ground saying yay yay so some of you could have a child that is and Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra whoever this child is you're standing your grounds to this child or this situation okay because it could be someone also that um, is coming at you with negative uh, um, communication and you're standing your ground with this person then all of a sudden you realize you know this person is just blowing off their steam let them just blow off their steam and you just stand back and you just watch them okay um, and the third week going in the fourth week, the Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups is here. So some of you could be connecting, and if your son is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio between the ages of 25 and 40, this purse is going to be coming in, and your worries is going to be um there it, it, you know your worries is going to be over, but you're going to be having some regrets. So, um, your worries is going to be over but um, honestly you're going to be having some regrets whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpiring obviously um, for some of you um, out there there was a situation and the situation could have to do um, um, you know with this um, Knight of Cups. The situation could have to do with this Knight of Cups. And whatever it is, your worries is in the reverse form. And the energy of the Five of Cups is the regrets. Okay, debt and transformation. In the second week, um, whatever information and whoever comes at you is as if um, 
you're going to be um, discussing the situation and especially it's going to be affecting the women 40 and older okay because you're the central of the month so you, if you were 40 years and over old, older um, this is going to affect you more than anyone else in this month because um, what is happening and what is transpiring is that um, whatever the situation was whatever that you were trying to find in a strength with whatever um, you know ashness and words that was coming to you basically what is going to be happening now is that um, you're going to see the truth to a situation and this situation is going to come to an end okay the situation is going to come to an end um, some of you who were worried about someone um, who was sick might just pass away so if you um, had some worries about someone that was sick might just pass away and um, in the fifth, the fifth week this person might just pass away um, it is as if some of you were taking care of a parent or someone who was sick and um, in the um, in the in the fourth week they passed away and you have some regrets because you know you're really missing this person some of you um, Let's see what is coming out the energy of the tower another new energy that comes out the energy of the tower um, whatever is transpiring um, some of you your sorry your sorrows is going to come to an end whatever your sorrows was it's going to be coming to an end and um, especially you ladies who were worrying about your son or your daughter that was an um, uh, is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion some of you had some worries about this person but this worries is going to finally come to an end there is going to become an healing so obviously there is going to be a debt in the family whoever out there um, there is going to be a debt in the family because um, the debt and the tower is here so obviously someone is going to um, be passing away there is going to be regrets in the fourth week now I'm really really open this and um, people are saying that I shouldn't say when that is coming up some people are, 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 are you know happy when I say it. but um, um, it could be the night it could be an end of a negative situation is gonna come for the night of cups okay um, some of you are going to be having some regrets so if your son if your son is um, um, if your son is um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, there is going to be a tower energy there is going to be a blow up of something the end of something so um, maybe uh, and this is why you, you're no, no longer worried because it's going to there's going to be an end of something I am not seeing that he's gonna pass away but if your son was in some negative situation um, there's coming an end to it the energy of the tower and the knight of cups and the five of cups some regrets is going to be happening the outcomes is the energy of the Emperor the outcomes is the energy of the Emperor um, this is going to be good um, I, I'm, most of you are really thinking about standing your balance um, this is also good for the men over 40 uh, this has to do with some of you ladies um, could be finding your true um, purpose your career um, your career um, there's going to come to an end to something that was blocking you ladies and what is going to be happening is that you're going to be um, you know if you were having a, a situation where you weren't finding work or you weren't finding the right thing and that sort of a thing that is coming to an end there is a shift of consciousness there is a shift in the energies around you and you are going to be finding um, the right career to fit you and this is going to be extremely good so um this is this is positive um whatever the situation is it's very very um, positive especially for the ladies and men over the age of 40 it is going to be a very positive situation um, you know ladies um, you're going to be um, looked up on um, um, if you know you were looking for a, um, a new career and that sort of a thing because I'm seeing that some of you need to find inner strength or you see a situation for what it is and you're bringing an end to it 
in the first week in the second week I'm seeing um, that you finally seen the truth to a situation especially um, you lay this or seen the truth of a situation because you're the central of the month the month um, a lot of stuff is going to happen around you some of you ladies who are coupled up with the knight of cups so this person um, could be um, moving out of your life um, there could be an end and this person is moving out of his life it could be that they're um, they're going to be losing um, their work and that sort of a thing um, I'm seeing the tower and uh, their boss it's as if you know there is going to be an explosion about um, their work situation and that sort of a thing um, and you know there is going to be some regrets but uh, you ladies who have uh, um, your son that is a, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, I'm seeing here some um, some situation is happening but uh, you know you know you're not, not gonna you're no longer going to be worried about your son um, but you're going to be having some regrets okay you're no longer going to be worried about your son but you're going to really be having some great regrets whatever the situation is you're seeing the truth of a situation about your son some of you could be seeing the truth of a situation about your son some of you if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion I'm seeing that the queen of ones here is in a, is, um, your mom is letting you know something about a relationship that you have with someone who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion I'm seeing um, um, the energy of the hamper which is the outcomes of your um, um, the, uh, the outcomes of your month which is very